Hello, travelers to the stars. My name is Mark, and this is Tomes of Awesome. Before we move on, please click the bell notification button, like, subscribe, share this video if you wish to on your favorite social medias with friends and the like. This is my first ever uh, update or information video. Today is finally, at long last, finally come out, Subnautica on the PlayStation 4. I won't mention the Xbox because they had it up to eight months ago while we were still only just having it on Steam. Now, if you missed the hype train, which is more like a intergalactic space shuttle at this point for the fans of this game. I will simply say that's okay because as Captain Copernicus Quark in the Ratchet and Clank series is known for saying, space is big. Really, really big. In fact, it is so big that if you lost your car keys in it, it would be almost impossible to find. As such, in comparing space to the internet, it's entirely possible you could have missed this. However, that being said, this uh, this game uh, has half of its fame and its sales on Steam, uh, mostly thanks to Markiplier and Jacksepticeye. In fact, the creators actually took a moment to um, write them personal handwritten letters, snail mail style, to thank them for making people more aware of their game. Uh, and speaking of the creators, they also went out of their way to watch all of Mark and Jack's videos. And in addition, beyond watching their videos, they watched their videos in order to see bugs and flaws in the game. They essentially crowdsourced the videos of their customers playing their game in order to improve their game, which thus improves uh, customer quality satisfaction, which is actually really intelligent way of using mainstream media, if you think about it. Um, this game is so sophisticated that I don't have a gaming PC at home here. What I actually have is just the normal PC I use for Facebook. And I bought this game originally on Steam when it was in beta. And even now, it is complete on Steam. Um, my PC no longer reads the Reach, meets the uh, base requirements for uh, the graphics, and yet this game still plays perfectly on my PC. I only have maybe like one lag that lasts a second or two every hour or so. Uh, that's how sophisticated this game has become. Now, for those who don't know, this game is sort of like Minecraft, but with, as you can already tell here, way better graphics. Um, essentially, you are the last surviving member of a starship crew that crash lands on an alien oceanic planet, and you have to build and craft and make things in order to figure it out. Now, while there aren't any chapters uh, in this game mentioned, there are, in fact, chapters. Uh, certain things that you can't get beyond until you do this or you do that or you get this and that and so on and so forth. Uh, I am making this short little video because the truth of the matter is I am thinking about possibly doing this as an hour-long series of episodes instead of my usual 25 to half an hour minute video clips because there's just there's so much to do. On the other hand, if I do go ahead and do a half an hour video clip, I can uh, go ahead and mine for resources in between doing videos, which will definitely cut up the boringness of this because sometimes you just have to craft resources, you know. You just have to craft resources. And then, of course, I can just go and reveal what I've done in my submarine lately and stuff like that. Um, I think I'm... Actually, now that I think about it, maybe I will do the half an hour videos for that reason, because it'll, it'll cut down on a lot of time that I'll be spending mining for resources, copper and acid mushrooms to make batteries and the like. As per usual, I will be talking and about various things in this game and giving tips. However, there is so much of this data that I had to tell first now that I didn't want to be talking for half the video because honestly, 
playing this game, getting spooked, and hearing fish laugh at you in the water is kind of an experience in and of itself. So we will be getting to that in a different video other than this. I'm not about to start playing Subnautica. I am, but I'll be recording that in a separate video entirely. So, uh, for those of you who are ready for this, I am Mark, this is Tomes of Awesome, and Subnautica is no longer coming. It's here. See you then.